Hey fellow readers, Bookworm Reader here, and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be the weekly, I guess you would call it weekly vlog, that's what I've seen a lot of people go, like pretty much weekly wrap up. It's what I've read, what I'm working on this week. So that is counting from May, from May, yeah, from May 1st until today's date, which is May 8th. So, just kind of that. Um, so for you guys who have seen other videos, seen my, oh my gosh, I can't speak right now, seen my May's TBR, if not, make sure to go check it out. But without further ado, let's go and jump into the video. <laughs> So like I said, if you guys haven't seen May's uh, TBR, make sure to go check that out. And that way you know kind of what to expect, what my prompts were for, what my prompts were that I pulled this month. And that way you know pretty much what I'm reading and you're just confused. And anyway, so without further ado, let's go ahead and, like I said, let's go ahead and jump in the video. So with, so I have finished two books this week or this previous week, two books on my TBR, and the books I have finished are Night Class, which is right here, and then 13 Reasons Why. Um, I believe I gave Night Class three stars, and I gave 13 Reasons Why five stars. 13 Reasons Why is definitely a book that I definitely recommend, although I don't recommend it if you are really sensitive to the subject of suicide, or because it deals with, like, the whole, like, story basically the main character gets since these tapes on why this girl decided to commit suicide so yeah um and then night class I believe I gave three stars that was a super easy read I finished that on day one and so it was just like a book that I was able to like sit down read and then like sit down and read in one sitting because it was only like 62 pages if you guys can hear my daughter I'm really sorry I had to go in her room to get these three books because my husband hid them in there and I woke her up. I was hoping I wouldn't wake her up, but I did. So, yeah, that's a thing. Cause he's a jerk like that sometimes where he'll just like hide stuff from me if I don't get enough done on the room. But anyway, um, so currently working on, I am currently working on Eleanor and Park by Rainbow Rowell. I am 106 pages into it. I'm really enjoying it. I'm pretty sure this is going to be a five star. Um, so yeah, I'm pretty sure it's going to be five star. Like I said, I'm 106, 107 pages. I'm not sure which page I'm on at the second moment, but into it. I'm really enjoying it, and I love how it like, switches between the different like two characters' perspectives. It switches between Eleanor and Park's perspective. Like Sometimes it'll do a mid-chapter, but it tells you when it's switching so that you're not confused and it's just not wait what so that's kind of nice also it's written in verse i think that's the reason why i've gone through so much of it in like the past couple of days although i what this was on last month's tbr and i had read like i think like 32 pages of it but i have gone further in it so yeah also working on city of fallen angels i actually have not started this one yet well okay we'll put this on books i have not started yet so we'll go back to that one um, also currently working on Scarlet by Marissa Meyer. This is the second book in the Lunar Chronicle series. I'm pretty sure I've mentioned them multiple times. I'm on page 84. This was also on last month's TBR. I didn't finish it. Um, but I'm hoping to finish it this month so I can return it. So maybe I can work on the next book next month. So, because I do have two readathons that I'm working on next month that I'm participating next month so we'll get to that later when I do wrap up or uh June's TBR but uh so I'm in chapter nine and I like I'm really enjoying this series I'm pretty sure this is also gonna be five star just like Cinder was and can't wait to finish it I'm hoping that I can get through this super easy also working on I can't show it well actually I can't show you I can show you <laughs> Sorry guys, I'm still got a little cough from croup. Um, so what happened is I got croup and then it just got like, I don't get over illnesses super fast. I get like small doses of it and then it takes me a couple weeks or so to get over it. I'm also currently working on Eldest, which is the second book in the Inheritance series. Most people know as the Aragon series. The first book is Aragon. Um, I'm pretty sure that this is out of date though because I was listening to it and I've 
So according to Audible, I have like five, a little over five hours left in the book. So I should be able to finish that today. So fingers crossed, you'll probably hear like if I finished it next week. As far as haven't started yet, we have City of Fallen Angels by Cassandra Clare. This is the fourth book in the Mortal Instruments series. I'm just like ready to be done with this series. Um and like be able to move on from it like I love this series like I'm not gonna lie I love this series I'm just ready to be done with it for you guys who have I've mentioned this in multiple videos for you guys who have been in on been watching for many years you know that I've been working on this series since the beginning of my booktube channel um one of my very first videos I had City of Bones in it and it was a current reads so you guys know that I've been working on this series for a while now I'm hoping to be able to finish this and possibly work on to um next month's work be able to get the next book in the series on next month's TBR. Also as far as haven't oh. cancel. Also as far as haven't started yet, we also have um well I've opened it. I haven't actually started it. We have Invaluable by Holly J. Wood. It's the first book in the in I believe it's called the Invaluable series or trick trilogy so i believe there's three books in it um haven't started yet although i'm really super excited for that one i was one of, this is that's one of the ones i part of the library so i actually do have to like get that one done um also as far as haven't started i have not started where is it oh geez how to find it i also have not started bruce singer which is the third book in the um inheritance series I think that is all like I finished two books I've shown you <coughs> let me actually just look because I want to make sure that I'm actually like just like talking about all the current ones um yeah I guess that's all it just seems like less than what I actually have on my TBR so yeah that is kind of like what's going on as far as current reads um I do plan on finishing eldest today um, that is a given. Like, I'm going to finish that book. I am going to try and get through Invaluable within the next couple days because I do need to return it to the library. I'd have to look. I think I've got like six or seven more days left on it. Um, Eleanor and Park, I plan to try and finish this week as well because it's probably the book that I am the furthest in. Um, I want to try and start City of Fallen Angels at least and get mostly through Scarlet. So, um, yeah, get mostly through Scarlet. Uh, like, at least, you know, halfway through Scarlet, because I don't think I'm even halfway through it yet. Um, but like I said, yeah, be able to at least get halfway through Scarlet, finish Eleanor Park, finish, um, Eldest start City of Fallen Angels, as well as within the next week finish Invaluable and start Bruce Singer. So we'll see how that goes. Um, but yeah, see how that goes. Hopefully, so like I said, there's two books, two down, six more to go. Um, and I actually am going to start doing punishments again because. The last couple of readathons I decided not to do, like the last couple of months I decided not to do it, but I'm actually going to go back to punishments. So we'll talk more about that when I do my TBR for next month. But there's that. Um, also, if you are reading any of these, make sure to comment down below and maybe we can do a buddy read and we can like figure out some way to like buddy read it because that'd be great because I really want to be able to do buddy reads. Um, so yeah, I will... See you guys next time. So until next time, read on readers.